Thanks very much, Kunta. Now, ESCOM wants the government to make a decision on who is going to be allocated the nuclear power project. Speaking at the opening of the Africa Utility Conference in Johannesburg today, Chief Executive Brian Damas said a decision is needed soon. South Africa has to add about 9,600 megawatts of nuclear energy into the electricity grid. It is estimated that this will cost about 700 billion rands. ESCOM has not yet secured the funding for this. It says it is unable to plan for this until a decision is made on who is going to be responsible for this project. From our perspective, we have seen the implementation around the renewables. I mean, that has come through and we've seen the announcements. Uh, it is the big decisions, the baseload decisions that needs to be made early. Uh, you know, we'll be finishing Kosilo in about 2019, around there. Uh, so if the next power station needs to be operational by 2020, it takes 10 years and we're already eight years out. So what we would like to see is the decision making around the allocation of who should do this and which projects we should work on, that that should start. Uh, and because that's very important from a planning perspective. Damas says it's also time for other energy options such as gas to be explored. I have reflected on the fact that the country needs to seriously consider uh, what I call game changes. You know, energy efficiency is one. It is a certainty we should do that, we should invest in it. And we believe gas is another one. Uh, you know, whether it's natural gas uh, within the region, uh, which can be power, can be built very quickly, or for that matter, unconventional gas, uh, where we see, particularly in the US, we had a significant change in the energy landscape there. The Africa Utility Week brings together utility professionals from more than 60 countries. It will continue until the end of the week. Diabo Zito, Business News, Johannesburg. At the same time, ESCOM's